What's up guys, today I'm going to bring you a Time Splitters 2 commentary. Why? Because I feel like it. I just woke up this morning and thought, you know what I want to do? I'm going to play some Time Splitters 2. Let's go for it. Let's go for... I'll probably play the first campaign level, which is Siberia. Uh, I think I do have a save file on this, but uh, just, just have a little check. And if you guys want to see more of this, just let me know in the comments and I shall do more. And apparently I don't have a save file. Hmm, interesting. No worries, it's the first level anyway, so who cares? Time Splitters 2 is one of my all-time favorite games. Probably the best out of the Time Splitters series. Uh, where's my favorite level? Atom Smasher. There it is. But uh, start with Siberia. Start from the start. Now, I can do hard mode, but it usually takes me multiple attempts, and I don't want to do this commentary like multiple times and then sync them all together and stuff. So I'm just going to go for normal. Just go for the safe option. Blah, 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 secret research, blah, 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 biohazard, blah, 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 Russians. There we go. Let's make a little start on this. Time Splitters is where I got the idea for a uh, default flipped button layout for when I play Call of Duty. I think it was Time Splitters or Goldeneye, one of those two. But um, yeah, I haven't played too many shooters in my time, but this is definitely the one I've played the most. More than Call of Duty, in fact. Having said that, I haven't played this in probably a few months, so I'm going to be a little bit rusty at first. Got to get used to the controls again from uh, Black Ops. I'm using a little child's controller. This controller I've got in my hand is like half the size of a normal PS2 controller. Uh, let's check the... have I got the right controls? Pick up the sniper. How do I zoom? There we go. I'm just going to start that again. <laughs> that was fucking terrible. The first shot and I miss it. For this first little bit, it's basically a stealth bit. You haven't been seen at this current moment. And what you're supposed to do is just take them all out. Again, that was fucking terrible. You're supposed to just take... What's with this sensitivity? You're supposed to just take them all out. <laughs> this is embarrassing. Without any of them noticing you. Even these cameras as well. Look, got to keep a steady hand for this. No, oh, please. Sorry, this is going to be really, really horrible to watch for some of you guys who have played this before. I, I can't... My finger is broken. I can't keep it still. Alright, there we go. No idle sway, luckily. Otherwise I'd be screwed. Right, I know there's a few guys in here. There's actually a little challenge mode in this game. Where it builds in certain, um, you know, points from the campaign. Like certain extracts from it into challenges. And like this is one of them where you've got to take out a few guys without being seen on this map. See if I can get this guy. There we go, first time. Switch to the pistol. This little thing's called the temporal uplink. It's extremely useful for stealth. I have to get in there from above. But uh, basically allows you to find people. Yeah, there he is. I thought that was going there. See if I can get him. He will die one headshot. I can't fucking press the trigger. There we go. I was pressing it, I was thinking, what am I doing? And I'm pressing, like, the plastic at the back of the trigger. That was stupid. Uh, these little files, once you get the time mines, you got to blow these up. Let's see, let's see. Whack out the old temporal uplink. Oh, shit. Why is, why is she not appearing? Oh, I guess she's not moving. That's why. See if I can actually shoot this. Come on. My god. <laughs> I can't... Right, good. This is going to be embarrassing for me to watch back. Alright, I'm going to ignore that camera for now. Look at this, you can see the guy coming from the side. Uh, if I just wait here... I'm going to wait for them to go, uh, turn around and go back, then I'll shoot them. Just avoid this camera. If you set the alarm off, they will start shooting at you, so you really don't want that. Let's see if I can get this guy. Come on, please. Let me have this one kill. There we go. Yeah. Believe it or not, I used to be really good at this game. Used to. Uh, let's switch off these... What am I doing? There you go. That's opened up the dam down there. I've got to get down there. I'm just going to blow up those things with a time mine. I believe you also have to blow that up, that communications dish. Let's check. Yes, there we go. Deactivate the communications dish. Who the fuck is shooting at me? Oh yeah, there's a guy up in the uh, tower. 
Right, okay. Yeah, it's all coming back to me now. Bang. Right, I know he's up there. What? Oh, I just walked into the camera, didn't I? That was stupid. All that stealth effort wasted. I'm tempted to just start again. Fuck it. Let's keep going. I can't believe I just walked into that camera immediately after, uh, like, avoiding them all. Should have just destroyed them to stop myself doing that. Hmm. They put a, a limiter on this rate of fire, so I can't actually get it any faster than that. It's like World at War all over again. Uh, that... Oh, there we go. That's what I wanted. Switch camera off. There we go. Now. Now, now, now. We will blow up this. Bang. Now for this communications dish. I think there's only two filing cabinets in this little area. Well, I really hope there is. Yeah, let's stick two on there. Why not? And we head into the dam. Once I check here. Anything... Yes, sniper ammo. Hooray. Right. Right, you can also be stealthy on this bit as well. How do I crouch? I have literally forgotten how to crouch. L1? Yeah, there we go. Right, crouch under this. High pressure steam. It hurts you. Da, 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 da. There he is. Let's go for the stealth approach. With a loud beeping explosive. Yep. He wasn't going to live that. <laughs> and he's got catapulted up there. Wow. Mm, there's a camera there, so I guess I'll just blow it up. Why not? I think you get more time mines later, so I'm not too worried about wasting them. This is actually my second favourite level. My favourite... No, I, I said my favourite is Atom Smasher, didn't I? I take that back. Atom Smasher is my second favourite. This is my third favourite. My actual favourite is Neo Tokyo. Which I would be showing you guys now, but it's not very interesting to watch. There's not much shooting involved. Oh, come on! I am really out of practice. I so um, uh, <laughs> sorry about this, guys. Right. There we go. I'm still crouched. Why is this? Time Splitters is a ridiculously fast-paced game. If you've ever tried playing arcade mode on this, um, well, multiplayer, I guess. I, I never played multiplayer online. Just because the servers were down by the time I actually got my PS2 online. But, um... I can imagine it being extremely fast-paced. I Why did I tilt downwards at that exact moment? Normally I can get these guys just instantly. Ah, uh, shoulda, woulda, coulda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now for the embarrassing cleanup. Come on. Have at the... These guys have got, um, automatic rifles, and <laughs> I got this little pistol. There we go. Soviet S-47. Is that supposed to be an AK-47? I don't know. At 66%! Okay, I know there's more down the end. Fire in the hole? Noob tubes for everyone! Oh, I guess there's no one down there. Okay. Never mind. Steam pressure at 33%. Hmm, I could just blow that up. Or I could just turn the steam off. Yeah, if you try and do it without turning off the steam, you just get hurt by it, so you might as well. I know there's a camera in here. Nope, maybe that's just on hard mode. Hmm. 
Yeah, there is quite a big difference in the difficulty modes in this. Right, there's a guy there. Yep, there he is. Didn't really have much of a chance to sneak there. Should we go for the loud approach? Yep, fuck it. Bye bye. Go for the Rambo approach. Dum de dum de dum de dum. More armor. This is. I should just turn the sensitivity down, it's too high. But this is default time splitter sensitivity. This is what I'm used to. Hmm. Dum de dum de dum de dum. Alright, let's go stealth again now. What the fuck? Where did you come from? Is there any more? Nope, never mind. Ah, well, let's just get the sniper out and take this camera out. Oh god, I really hate doing this. I blame the controller. It's a shitty kid's controller. I can't. Please! My arm is shaking like a diabetic. Ah. Yes, thank you. Bet they've seen me now. Ah, there's normally... Yeah, there he is. I didn't know if that was just for hard mode or for normal as well. Thank you. Now, back to business. What is this guy doing? Oh, don't run away. Oh, my God. Shit. Oh, well, loud approach it is. Where is he? Where's the other guy? Way ridiculous sensitivity. Yep, yeah, got him eventually. I am a master of stealth. I think that's it for this little area. Time crystal located. I can see a guy there. I think that's the Anaconda cart. Anaconda cartridge, sorry, which is like a mini game you can add into the temporal uplink. Where's this guy going? Right, okay. See if we can get a sneaky little pistol shot on him. Oh, there's two of them. Shit. Uh, not so sneaky. Oh, you know, that was almost sneaky. They didn't shoot me, so... Anaconda. Shall we play a bit of Anaconda? Yes, I think we should. Anaconda. How do you use Anaconda? I forgot. Square, triangle, there we go. I'll just show you a bit of this, not to waste too much time. It's a mini game, it's uh right, it's basically snake, I guess. Three three hundred and sixty degree snake. I'm not trying hard by the way, I'm just showing you basically what it is. Back to the game. Um do 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 do. Oh, I didn't press that. Right. <laughs> this is an interesting, interesting, sorry, interesting little novelty. If you press this alarm, um, well, it does exactly what it says in the tin. It sets the alarm off and they come rushing up to kill you. Um, do I want to do that to clear the area? I don't know. I might just try it the stealthy way first. That camera's going to annoy me if it stays there. Sorry, where is it? It's not even on this floor, is it? Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Is there something in these showers? I seem to remember there being health in here. Nope, there's absolutely nothing. Maybe that's only on easy mode. Alright. I got you now. Let's see if I can get him. This is honestly horrible. I... Please. Thank you. Right. Ooh, 
tricky, tricky, tricky. There it is. Got it. Is there another guy in here? Yes, there is. It's our lady friend. Hello, lady friend. Alright, pull out the AK. Right, blow this up. Bring out the time mine. This is taking longer than I expected. I kind of expected this to be like a... Oh shit. Get the armor, get the armor. I've got full armor, never mind. Kind of expected this to be a 15 minute thing. Maybe you can do it in 15 minutes. I'm just doing it at a, like a reasonable pace. But uh... Yeah. I think this is the last of the filing cabinets. Bang. You only need one, but I'll put two anyway. And a fire extinguisher, which is always nice. Yeah, there we go. I, th I thought I'd miss one there, and I was like, what? But, uh... Yeah, time crystal's just on the floor below. This bit's interesting. Again, this is a bit you can do without being seen. If you get your shots right. Will I be able to do it? Probably not. Uh, okay, we can get that guy. And someone heard me. I did them in the wrong order. Whack out the AK. No? Have they not seen me yet? This guy's seen me. There we go. Nice little shot on him there. Alright, let's bring out the temple uplink. Really? Is that all there is? No, there's another one in the middle there. Okay. Yeah, you see me. Let's put up the AK. I keep saying AK, I don't even know if it is an AK. Right, done. No, not done. Bastard. Dee -dee -dee. Yeah, I'm kind of glad I didn't pick hard now. How long do you think I would have lasted on there? Uh, let's blow up these little uh, mini guns. Why are they called mini guns? They're anything but mini. And in here, you get a. No, you don't. You need to get the disc from there. But you do unlock that gate first, I think. Let's pick up a fire extinguisher for no apparent reason. Wow, we're coming up to 20 minutes now. I think there's armor here, yeah. And grenades! Extra noob tubes, brilliant. You get a tactical 12 gauge in here. If I just take out this young gentleman. Watch this. See him there? This is fucking hilarious, look. Do 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 do. So unnecessary, but so hilarious. Okay. Actually, where's that? There it is. That's what I want. Favorite gun in the game. Oh look, there's lifeless zombies on the floor. I wonder what's going to happen. It's a semi-automatic shotgun. Okay, that doesn't fire as quickly as I thought it did. Right, to kill the zombies, all we need to do is shoot the head off. Um, if I can just find my uh, assault rifle. Fuck's sake. One shot to the head kills him. Done. Releasing lockdown. Bring out the 12 gauge. I think there's a guy in one of these. No, there's not. Okay. There's the time crystal. Uh, you know what happens if I get it. No, nope, not yet. Oh yeah, yeah, they come to life when you uh, put the disc in and then you have to go back and destroy the uh, container of some sorts. Actually, do you... Did I pick up that disc? Yeah. 
That's what I need. You put the computer disc in there, and it brings up some, uh... I, I don't know what it is, some crystal thing you gotta blow up. Some... How do I describe it? I don't even know what it is. Something comes out of that hole in the ground with a rope attached to it. Containment failure. Yep. Sounds about right. I'm hoping they only come from that direction. So I'm too lazy to turn around and look. Aim for the head, aim for the head, aim for the head! I'm aiming, damn it! What are you gonna do? He's like the, like the Black Knight from uh, Monty Python. Tis but a flesh wound. Crap. Aim for the head. And they're behind me as well. Brilliant. I did not expect. Oh god. He's got a gun. He means business. Let's use the fire extinguisher. Well, let's not. Ah! Okay. I think we taught him his lesson. So if we move down here... I think we'll get more zombies coming to life. Yeah, there we go. Container. That's what we call it. Container. More fucking zombies. And you haven't even seen the time splitters yet. I think three kills it. Yep. Now we go back and get assaulted by some Russian soldiers. Bang, 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 bang. I just fucking blew myself up. That was stupid. Let's get the armor back. Um, what is this? A flamethrower? Wow. That guy's got like two faces built into one. That's interesting. Um... Where was the armor? There was some armor earlier that I couldn't get because I already had full. I honestly can't remember where it was. Eh. Let's see if we can go without it. Right. Bring it. Come on, where's the rest of you? The rest of yous. And it's a flaming zombie. I wonder how long he was standing there for, waiting for me. Goes without saying, if you walk into him, you catch on fire, and <laughs> once you catch on fire, you're pretty much dead. I think you can put yourself out with a fire extinguisher. It's, I mean, it's not like the game makes it obvious to you or anything, you basically have to assume that you can do that. You can, but you basically have to spray and walk into your own fire extinguisher spray. Oh, it's just five grenades. It's the easy way. This guy's still alive. This was a triumph. Sorry, I just completed Portal the other day. Bang, bang, bang. Ah, there we go. There, there was an armor, wasn't there? I'm not just imagining this. Yes, no. Go away. Oh, fuck off. Yeah, it, it basically alternates between, you know, human soldier, zombie. Prefer the zombies, if I'm honest. They don't shoot you. Um, yeah, there it is. I didn't imagine it. Oh, this doesn't look good. Holy crap, he's firing grenades at me. Interestingly, the human soldiers will go for the zombies and you. I guess that's what you'd expect. It'd be a bit harsh if they both went for you and not each other. No, no flamethrower for you. There are people outside my house. Hmm. I assume they're not for me. Right. And there's a zombie out here. Of course. Hey, yeah, just uh, taking a skiing holiday with the family. Bang. 
Don't allow any mutants to, to survive. Complete. I'm out of shotgun ammo. If we just... I think we have to head up to the dam now. Now that power's been restored, you can use the lift up to the top. There are mutants. I thought I did the do not allow mutants to survive challenge. God's sake. D did you... Did I just imagine that? Do not allow any... Let's check. Do not allow... Don't allow any mutants to survive. Oh look, mutants. Interesting. Alright, let's go up. <sighs> I'll be surprised I have enough health to complete this. Okay, let's give it a go anyway. Why the fuck not? Right, you have to take the lift from the top to get to the top. The other lifts will just take you to uh, other places, basically. Going up. Now, I believe you have to shoot down some kind of gunship from the top using uh, turrets. Yeah, here we go. That's what we want. Right, access the top of the dam. Here we go. That's what we want. Ah! Definitely don't want to stand there, friend. Okay, where's this? Oh, shit. How do I find missiles? Oh, there we go. R1. Ah! Get out of my way! Innocent bystander. It's alright. Collateral damage. That's what they say in the movies, isn't it? Collateral damage. Fuck, there's a time portal. How do I get off this thing? Get out my way. No. Complete. There were no time splitters in that one. Normally, once you get the time crystal, uh, these things appear out of nowhere and start trying to electrocute you and uh, all kinds of bad things. But uh, those are the time splitters anyway. If you guys want to see more, just let me know. That was quite a long video, actually, nearly half an hour. But um, if you sat through this far, then hey, you are amazing. But um, yeah, see you later. Please like the video if you enjoyed it, and bye-bye.